Football away days to many is just another football game. However, there's something about away games that get fans travelling all over the country to watch their team. Week in, week out, no matter the previous results, football away days seem to be very popular amongst football fans. Let's find out why that's the case. I'm Liam and today I'll be making the 169 mile trip to the Amex Stadium in Brighton to experience my first away day with over 1,000 Birmingham City supporters. So what's so special about an away day? Let's get talking to some fans. Mates, there just always seems to be a better atmosphere and a better togetherness with the fans. Um, even from getting on the coach to while we're at the game. Atmosphere, you don't travel four hours um, to a game expected to lose uh, without getting up and involved, sing song, no matter what happens. And that's probably the, the funniest part about the away days. Obviously, the start of the day the atmosphere, get on the coach, go, go to actually to the ground, get behind the team and having a real good day out. I get the sense as to why away days are so special. This is the only first part of the journey, so let's get going. Okay, just three hours until we arrive in Brighton, but before we get talking to some fans, here's some away day facts to share. Did you know the average away day crowd at Skybet Football League matches totaled to 1.48 million fans last season? However, did you also know? The deepest championship away day for away fans is in fact actually Birmingham City. For a total of £23.10p, you can get yourself a match day ticket, pie and even a cup of tea. That's what I call leading by example. So what makes an away game so different to a typical home game? Let's go find out. Just the atmosphere and you know, you're making your way up there to the pub, have a laugh and a bit of banter with the home supporters. Travelly, the day out, a bit of fun along the way, a few pubs and what my mate said earlier, meet up with some of the home fans and have a bit of banter with it. Well mainly it's the atmosphere, nothing can beat the away days atmosphere. There's other things included like just getting away from your hometown. So that's what I call dedication. No matter if results are going your way, you always stick by your team. So I got myself a coffee. Next destination, Brighton. We'll see you there. The fact that Blues fans want to hear, but with only two wins out of 20, does the poor run of form affect fans attending away games? Let's find out. Not in the slightest. Not in the slightest. Win, lose, or draw. It's about it's about meeting the people, it's about coming to the grounds and meeting the people. No, it just affects my mentality on the result, but I take a point at these kind of games now rather than a win. You come expecting a point rather than a win. No, it doesn't. You, you've got to try and get behind them as best you can. And if we win, lose or draw, it's you've got to get as much support behind them and hopefully build for next season. Welcome to the Amex Stadium, the home of Brighton and Hove Albion Football Club. After a three-hour journey, I think it's time for some more away day facts. So Brighton and Hove Albion Football Club were formed 115 years ago on the 24th of June 1901. The 31 meetings between the two sides, Brighton have won 12 <laughs> times, Blues have won 10, which means a draw of 9 games between the two sides. Just a random fact, Brighton currently sell the most expensive pies in the championship at a whopping £4.10p. Whereas Burton and Wigan sell the cheapest at £2.60. Crazy, yeah? It's three hours to arrive here. As you can see, fans are already preparing themselves for the game. So I think it's time to head it to the ground.
Wow, what an experience. I've talked to plenty of fans and their dedication is astounding. No matter what, you follow your team. Today I've learned an away day is more than just a football game. It's a group of fans all sharing the same passion and showcasing that wherever they follow their team. Thank you for taking an inside look into what an away day is and why millions of football fans love it. This has been Liam Clarkson and this has been my away day experience.